improving on a little bit. Yeah, even though he only threw for 140 plus yards. Meanwhile, the Lions came into the day in first place in the NFC North. Could Green Bay lose three in a row at home? Brett Favre, the Packers have struggled in the end zone. We saw it this morning on NFL Countdown. Bryant Westbrook breaks up a pass. Pack settled for a field goal, although he was all over Schrader. Time. We see interference calls so often. Watch what Westbrook does to Schrader hit, and he never gets the call. So, you know, a lot of times it's a mystery as to what the officials see. So twice in the red zone, the Pack can only get a field goal at 7-6 Detroit. Gus Ferrat starting for an injured Charlie Batch. Touchdown to Jermaine Crowell, who had a big day. He had 8 for 112, and the Lions lead 17-12 at the half. But in the second half, first bad news, real bad news for the Pack. Antonio Freeman, a hit from the helmet from Mark Carrier. Leaves the game with a concussion, does not return. Next play, far for Corey Bradford. Not a catch, but an, uh, an interference penalty on Terry Fair. It was unfair. 41-yard penalty. Next play. You like this after you have a team back on its heels a little bit, Tom. Far for the end zone. And Bradford makes this tremendous catch. The pack end up getting a two-point conversion to make it 20 to 17. Far ecstatic. Bradford with a big catch. And Bobby Ross wanted to challenge it. Well, what a great catch by Corey Bradford. And you have to get the help of the guys upstairs if you're Bobby Ross. Corey Bradford right here going to bobble this ball a little bit at first with one hand, but he clearly brings it in, gets it into his body, and has control before he ever rolls out of bounds. So the challenge cost the Lions a timeout. So the score now 23-17 late third. Barack is picked off by Fred Vincent, just overthrown, and Vincent returns into Lions territory. The Lions with, what, four times as many penalty yards as yards in total offense in the third quarter. Fourth quarter... Favre out of his end zone, so he's feeling it. A little more rhythm in the second half. Favre to Bill Schrader, 35 yards. They chew up the clock. The Lions eventually down to about the six-yard line, but they were down nine. They couldn't convert late. And so the Packers end up winning it 26-17 to to even their mark at five and five. And they did it just in time because with Green Bay, they knocked Detroit now back into a tie for first place with now 6-4 and four, Tampa and Idle, Minnesota. Dorsey Levin's more in the air than on the ground, but 146 total offense yards.